Um, in other news, Justin Fields also had his fifth-year option declined, which we've talked about, and that uh, comes as no surprise. What does come as a little bit of a surprise, and by a little bit, I mean a massive surprise, is that Jalen Warren dropped on Cam Hayward's Not Just Football podcast that special teams coordinator Danny Smith has some very unique and interesting plans for quarterback Justin Fields, saying that uh, he actually has mentioned Justin Fields returning kicks for the Pittsburgh Steelers this year I mean, backup quarterback, maybe you get two QB sets, and then on special teams, screw it, you got to earn your place somewhere. You got to see what you got in this guy. Let's just send him back there and be a kick returner. Who cares about Cordero Patterson? We got Justin Fields. Uh, your thoughts when you heard that? Yeah, um, I was pretty excited by this. I think this is pretty <laughs> cool. You know, I mad scientist Danny Smith cooking some stuff up in the lab. Yeah. I, I kind of love it. Um, you know, you bring up Cordell Patterson. In the new kickoff formats, it's pretty easy to kick away from a dangerous return guy. And if you've got yeah. two back there, uh, that makes you a real threat everywhere. They they have to either give you a touchback or kick it to a really dangerous returner. Mm -hmm. um, and I think also, I mean, this is obviously very different from the old kickoff rules. Like, yes. it, I think it's going to accomplish what it intended to do, and that's limit injuries. So that's the case. I mean, why not? Why not give Justin a chance to to see what he can do with the ball in his hands? He's he's electric. He's proven that over his entire career. Um, I know there are questions about him as a passer. There are no questions about him as a runner. No. Um, so I, I think it's closer to kind of a normal line of scrimmage play <laughs> uh, where you can where you can he can catch the ball and he can see a hole, hit a hole. I, I think that's a possibility. I would love to see it. I don't think we're going to. No, I, I, like someone, someone is going to have to save Danny Smith from himself because this is this is an idea that is fun, but not probably not worth the fun, uh, not worth the risk for the fun. Could you imagine? Could you imagine if you're saying, "Hey, Cordero, I know we just signed you two years to be our kick returner. You're our guy. We love it. So excited. Uh, we're going to put Justin back there. We're actually Justin's going to be our kick returner just to start the season. We'll see how it goes. You know, if he doesn't die, then." We'll toss you back there. I think that'll work out just fine. Look, I'm all for it. I was saying before the show, Justin Fields rushing over was the easiest bet in football the last two years when he plays. It's just, it doesn't matter what the number is. It's you hammer the over because it's just that easy of a bet. I think the dude is electric with the football in his hands. I think this goes two ways. If you are thinking about Justin Fields as a quarterback at any point in the NFL, you're not putting him back there. You're not saying, you know what? We'll just risk it. You know what? Screw it screw it we just extended him for two years and we feel really good and this is all this is guessing that they're going to extend him let's go put him as a kick returner and second you have some pretty good kick returners i mean you have cordero patterson you have calvin austin you can put jalen warren back there i'd feel great about jalen warren as a kick returner i just feel like there's a lot of names before you go backup quarterback and i get it if we're playing madden i'm all about it but regular real life football a little bit dangerous for a guy who's not supposed to get hit and uh, should probably not be getting hit in Justin Fields. So, guys, this is a public service announcement, and it is urgent. You think that you have mastered the look in sweatpants and joggers? Well, guess what, my friend? You have not. You are one step away from wearing pajamas in public, and your significant other is starting to think that you look like a slob. It's time to take your sexy ass and put it in some jeans. If you take anything away from today's show, it's that the perfect jean isn't just another pair of stiff, uncomfortable, nut-crushing pants. They have cracked the code on solving your denim difficulties, and it is time to rejoice. Check them out. Always looking good. The Perfect Jean makes great looking, perfect fitting jeans that are as comfortable as sweatpants and more stretchy than a kangaroo's pouch. It's made from a special denim fabric that's super soft, just like sweatpants, just like joggers, but it doesn't make you look like a slob. And the best part, they make six fits from skinny to thick thick waist sizes from 26 to 50 and lengths from 26 to 38 so whether you are a thick thick guy or a short king or guess what anything in between they perfectly fit your body and accentuate your assets pun intended trust us when we say that these are truly fucking perfect jeans once you try them on you'll never go back once again Boom. For a limited time, our listeners get 15% off their first order plus free shipping at theperfectgene.myc or just Google 
the perfect gene and use our code all steelers 15 for 15 percent off look at i have been looking for a while i have been talking to my fiance daily i need to find a look i've tried them all i tried khakis i tried joggers i tried sweatpants i tried shorts nothing fits me like the perfect jeans fit me the perfect gene doesn't just stop there though they've revolutionized t-shirts as well the perfect t has just enough stretch to hide the beer belly while accentuating your arms and chest for that flawless look it's soft like butter without shrinking in the wash like all your other t-shirts it's just no well perfect the perfect gene always has free shipping, always has free exchanges, and always has free returns. So you can have peace of mind knowing that your order is completely risk-free. It's finally time to stop crushing your balls in uncomfortable jeans by going to theperfectgene.myc. Our listeners get 15% off your first order plus free shipping, free returns, and free exchanges when you use our code ALLSTEALERS15 at checkout. That's 15% off for new customers at theperfectgene.myc with promo code ALLSTEALERS15. After your purchase, they'll ask you where you heard about them. Please, please, please give us some support and tell them that we sent you. Fuck your khakis and get the perfect gene. I mean, you know, you think we see one in practice? Oh, I got to hope so. <laughs> Man, wouldn't that be that's that's probably going to be the the uh, the 2024 equivalent of the Kendrick Green fullback moment is yeah. going to be oh, way better. Way yeah. Kendrick oh, Green yeah. fullback. Cool. Justin Fields taking a kickback. That's like you've never seen that before in your life. Never. Yeah. You know, yeah, that's revolutionized a, football. That's a perfect like bust it out at the Friday Night Lights practice and just watch the crowd go absolutely nuts when they nuts. see him jog out there. Nuts. Yeah. 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 It could, Do you think it, Justin would push for it? I don't know about push for it, but I think he'd be all for it. Like, yeah. I think anybody who's on the bench would be like, hell yeah, put me in there. But I'll just, at the same time, I'd be like, all right, but I want this to be an understanding. I'm not playing wide receiver. I am yeah, a quarterback. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Slash kick returner. And that is all. That is as far as as we get there. Um, I think it's going to be awesome. I hope we get to see it at least, even if you're going to put a red jersey on him. Like, I hope yeah. we get to see it one time just to just to light the crowd up. It would be sick. 